and then get it your tombstone. I'll have to handle this. <laughs> oh. I don't need this abuse. <laughs> no, where are you going? Wait. <laughs> Grizz is leaving. That's it. I did. I, I broke it. <laughs> is he? Your f <laughs> hey, Grizz taking a break. He is uh, cooling off right now. Not, not feeling happy about <laughs> losing those level twos. But hey, we'll see what happens later. And right now we got Jason versus SoCal Tai, uh, and we got the uh, sp yeah sponsored by all of Southern California. Uh, and Jason sponsored obviously by a dentist or something, because uh, look at them teeth. Bergman's Family Dental Care. Uh, ooh, he's gonna catch him with that forward smash. Now, normally the upbeat is a strong, strong item, a strong way to kill. But Jason able to read that and, and kind of wait it out and hit him with the forward smash. All right. Ooh, going for the spike there, and Ty knowing knowing he has to kind of move out of it, lets himself kind of fall. Oh no! In the footstool. And dude, Mentos should sponsor Jason, dude. You see in the top right corner, those are actually his teeth, dude. No joke, no edits. Those are actually, that's his mouth. Dude. And, uh, man, that, that smile. All right, and Ty trying to bring this back, but struggling to take this first stock uh, at 150. Okay, commentator's curse. Gets it right away. And uh, right now, uh, Jason with a commanding lead over Ty. Uh, um, you will be hearing from him. Yeah. Um, unreal. You know what I'm going to tell your lawyer? What? I'm going to say, hey, are you Grizz's lawyer? And he's going to be like, yeah. And I'm going to be like, are you new? <laughs> And he's gonna, he's gonna call his lawyer, dude. <laughs> he's gonna call Ty to fire you. <laughs> yeah, dude, Ty, dude. Ty definitely needs to be a wrestling persona here in the Smash community. Always dress up, but just rip into people like Macho Man Randy Savage. You know what I mean? And Jason with the turtleneck again, rocking it, dude. In that yeah, it's the 1970s all over again. He was rocking that turtleneck on Monday, dude. And boy, it looks clean. Yeah, it looks good. It, it works for him. Especially because it's like nice. It's a nice maroonish color, maroon True. brown. Mm -hmm. And it's a uh, very Thanksgiving-y, dude. And that's what we got coming yeah. up this Thanksgiving. It kind of complements his skin tone. All right, Grizz, Thanksgiving, favorite food. What do you got? Um, when I was younger, it was definitely yams. Ooh. I definitely appreciate a good cranberry sauce. Sure. And I would say, um, I've only had it a handful of times, but uh, lamb is incredible for Thanksgiving. Ooh. Um, I don't even know if I've had lamb. Yeah, is those that, are some of my favorites. Is it like Greek food, lamb? Uh, there is a lot of lamb in Greek food, but like, if you just like make your, you know, you just cook your lamb optimally like it's just it's just very tender and very uh flavorful it's really really good. i'm a pretty big fan of i mean i like yam soup oh that's it um so hear me out the next day turkey sandwiches oh for sure yeah with all the fixings yeah 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 dude. absolutely or the best thing is like when you have like extra rolls from Thanksgiving, like you make like turkey sliders, like you put like a little bit of cranberry sauce, some mm. turkey, yeah, 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 uh, yeah, maybe yeah. a little mashed potatoes and like a little yeah. gravy or something. And what else? <laughs> what, what else? Yeah, I'm all, and what else? <laughs> what else do we got? Yeah, dude. Uh, Thanksgiving's awesome. I am excited for Christmas. See, when. <laughs> When Halloween comes around and I do my maze and we do the maze for three days, come the day before Halloween. Ooh, the day nice. before Halloween, I'm literally like, I'm done with Halloween. I'm ready for yeah. Christmas. Yeah. But, uh, oh, but people forget about Thanksgiving. Like I was over at my friend's house and his sister was playing 
uh, Christmas music, and I was like, no, Thanksgiving. And she's like, no, you're wrong. It's Christmas. People don't appreciate Thanksgiving. Bro, you have to give thanks. You gotta, you, you have gotta to let give thanks. thanks. You have to, dude. You have to. Um, yeah, I'm a big fan of Thanksgiving. Uh, it's uh, one of my mom's best holidays, where she really gets to shine. My mom's a good cook. Sure. Uh, I heard Troy's turkey is uh, out of this world. Troy, you got a turkey, dude? Yeah, what he's you, gonna mean. You turkey smoke it or what? Bake it at 450 for like three hours or what? No, nah, dude. What do you got, Troy? <laughs> he goes <sighs> and stretches a little bit, puts on that headset. Here we dude, go. I didn't know Chef Get Troy out your notepad. Get, get your notepad, guys. Troy Ramsey's, dude. What do you got, Troy? Talk to me, dude. Okay, so no stuffing. What? Whoa, okay. hot take. No stuffing. No, 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 no. Because all that bread in there, it absorbs all the yeah, juice. Yeah, yeah. It, it dries out, dry, out that burnt. Why do you think turkey's always so goddamn dry? Yeah. Because for the past 150 years, we've been putting bread, bread in the bitch. I've, my family does uh, has always done stuffing in a separate pot. Puts it with the necks. Okay. So what we put instead is uh, half an onion, so sliced in half, stuff that bitch in there, and half an orange. Oh. A little citrus. Yes, sir. Helps uh, tenderize that turkey from the inside. Peeled? Wow. Do you peel the orange? No. No? Peel it all. Yeah. Everybody. Put that orange zest in there. So, so an entire onion and an entire orange. Yeah, stuffed in there. Uh, halved and then the inside on against the edge of the bird with okay. the round facing it. Anyway. Dude. Sure. Um, I just thought of our next POW gaming venture. I think we've already Us said that. Us three truck. are going to do, we're going to take, uh, what is it, instructions that we see online, like that guy who spoiled the Popeye's chicken sandwich, and we're going to make Who won the last it. game? Who won the last game? Uh, uh Jason. Not 100%. It was Jason, for sure. Yeah, Jason did okay. switch characters. Then what you do is you release the skin from the meat. Okay. Leave it on there, but you'd like separate it or sure. get it in between and then fit. What do you put it and in then, between? And uh, then I make uh, four large sticks of unsalted butter, um, uh, two lemon zests of an entire lemon, lemon squeezed in there with a bit of um, uh, it, parsley. Sure. All mixed in that together. And then I slide that butter mixture in between the bird oh. and the uh, skin. Bro we, bro, we should do for the YouTube channel, we should do a, a, a Thanksgiving with, with, with Pow and just make all these recipes. Yeah, dude. <laughs> no, if we do a Friendsgiving, I'll hook it up. And that's going to keep the bird nice and moist because sure. that skin is so thin and so clean. Yeah. I'm yeah. going to try some over here. Um, there we go. Yeah. You ready for this? Yeah. yeah. Thick strips of turkey, or uh, uh, stri thick strips of bacon across the top. Ooh. Layered, like shingles, right? Like shingles, bro. Yeah, dude. My <laughs> hips are hard right now. <laughs> Throw that bird. Throw that bird and uh, in at 450 for 30 minutes. What else you got? Stop it. Stop it. Ooh, okay. Tell me more. Let it, uh, so let it, it, it gets a lot of high heat on it. Yeah. Then it nice and browns it. Then you bring that down to 350 and you cook it for, uh, per the instructions of the pound of the bird. Sure. Based every 30 minutes. What are you basing with? Based. So just like its own juices? Its own juices. Oh, fuck yeah. Its own juices, yeah. Bacon, onion, turkey. Ooh, double arrow. All that good. Oh, wow. Good in there. Okay. And then bring that boy out, let it rest for half the time that you had it in there. So if you cook the bird for four hours, let it rest for two hours, reabsorbs all those juices again. Oh, I see. Let it sit. How do you how do you let a bird rest without it getting cold? Do you just uh, leave it in can, there? On you can leave the foil over it, like a little bit of foil. Yeah. yeah. Okay. But its internal temperature, it takes a while for it to like really cool down. Mm -hmm. Okay, it makes sense. Yeah. Um, and then once it's rested, 
uh, take the remaining juices, the bacon, the onion, the orange, and start to mash that and start to make a nice gravy. Ooh, yeah. Well, so the bacon is not for eating, the bacon is more to make a gravy? Interesting. Bacon gravy? Are you fucking kidding me? Come on. Wow. No, yeah, for sure. I just Sounds thought that was like uh, an accoutrement for the bird. Wow, okay. Interesting. And then you pour that back onto the bird when you slice it. Yeah, dude. Wow, wow, incredible. I'm absolutely intimidated about making a turkey, I'm not going to sure. lie. Uh, but I can make you guys a tri-tip that you wouldn't believe. So yeah. Let's go. Let's go. My friend taught me the secret of grilling is quality meat, salt, and yeah. four minutes on each side. That's it. And nice. Ty taking it. Let me tell you something. With the tri-tip, dude, you're not even on the grill. You guys, you're in the oven, one, dude. Right? Okay. You take that tri-tip to the oven, and you do a sear, sear. You're good. Sure. sure. I'm out. What do you got for sides, Troy? Oh, uh, my grandmother's uh, broccoli cheddar casserole. Ooh. Mm. Incredible. None of my aunts and uncles know how to make it. Only me. My grandma, <laughs> when she passed away. She taught me how to make it, and I'm the only one in the family that knows how to make it proper. Wow. Wow. That's. You know, my wife, my wife right and their down. family, they have a cheesy rice. Yeah. Oh, and it has rice in it. Yeah. Amazing. Dude. Yeah. yeah good. It's uh, broccoli, celery, onion, uh, rice, and um, cheese. Uh, oh, you guys do yours with the broccoli in this. Oh. Uh, hers is just. Bro, when I mean cheese, I mean like blocks of cheese and then rice. And I'm blocks. like, but it doesn't I didn't know over, such a thing. <laughs> it's it's not it doesn't it's not too much cheese. It never is, dude. There's no such thing as too much cheese, bro. Yeah, dude. Unless you're Jason and you're playing uh, Falcon, dude, huh? Nice segue. Yeah, thanks, dude. What's up with you, Baxi? How how do you uh? What's your favorite Thanksgiving dish? Yeah. Sour cream, some cheese maybe. Wow. Like, it's like double baked loaded potatoes. Are we talking to Idaho potatoes or are we talking these little ones? Yeah, yeah, on, that one, bro. Man. Russet, am I right? Yeah, Russet dude. potatoes, for sure, only. People try to get away with those little small ones. Dude. Freaking little... $70 a pound. <laughs> those I, little I haters, dude. Sure. I, nah. Yeah. Not the red ones, just small brown ones. If you're gonna get brown ones, just go Idaho. Why not? Yeah, yeah dude. Mutant, kind of, you know? Where you're not 100% sure if it had steroids put in it at one point? Yeah, dude. Wow, yeah. forward smash is getting him. Nice, double, all right, those, yeah. I mean, kinda, sounds like a good kinda, side. Those kind of potatoes where if your sister has one, she may or may not actually get hair on her back. <laughs> yeah, dude. What? Steroid levels, dude. Got it. Actually. Yeah. 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 Okay, I'm going to hit you guys with a little side. Here we go. What about in it? A little side hitter, because I love the pumpkin pie, obviously, and sure. the apple pie. Yeah. But you throw in a little ambrosia salad. Oh, there, yeah. Dude. Yeah, ambrosia salad is where it's at. My ex girlfriend's family turned me on to that. It's really freaking good. Yeah. yeah. yeah it's like. It, it's so, a secret hitter, bro. It's so, a secret hitter. So there's is is pistachio jello with fruit cocktail. That's what they do. Pistachio? Yeah. I No, no marshmallows. No. I've had one with marshmallows. I've had one that wasn't pistachio. And, and what? Cool whip. Yeah, cool wow. whip, not pistachios. And it's the fruit cocktail. Boom. And wal I've always, had it with uh, walnuts too. That yeah, I always oh, get it. Maybe, on my oh, side I think, when I think there is nuts maybe. Yeah. Okay, I throw a little wall that's Scarry's Ambrosia. That's where it's at. Yeah. Praline? Praline? I do like Praline. No, I, my family does not. It, that's just like nuts with I like sugar both, and... I get the both of both. I, I get the best of both worlds because my, my wife, they they have a, a white family, so they will have like the traditional turkey and stuff. And then I'll get my side of the family, which we have. We have, I mean, we have traditional too, but we have a lot of extra different Tomatoes. sides. You sure, know what I mean? Sure. Uh, we still have the turkeys. My family actually does two turkeys. Two turkeys. And uh, wait, wait, I make like sure I go home with a, a Ziploc, a gallon Ziploc of just turkeys for the next day turkey sandwich, which is by far the best thing 
about Thanksgiving is the next day, bro. You standing in line about to shop for Black Friday with two turkey sandwiches in your hand. I'm I'm about to elbow an old lady for a flat screen, bro. That's Christmas to me. That's Thanksgiving to me. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. Yo, I, have you guys ever done the whole hustle and bustle? Before online, obviously. Yeah. I went there when I was a kid. My mom took us to, to Walmart. And it oh, wasn't and it wasn't like we waited the night before. It was like it was like we got up at It's two and two. It was I literally we got up at five o'clock or four o'clock and we head down there and it was insane. Yeah. I've done the whole the whole, the whole stick, yeah. Um, my wife and I, we do like to go, but we go more with the idea of just like maybe not. Yeah, not not with the idea of like who we shopping for, because that I, I don't know how you can do that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're upset. So, I I heard this story recently on on, on YouTube. So as the story goes, um, it's Black Friday. And um, there's two two little kids. They're fighting over a display switch, a display oh. mall switch. And they get to fighting. And their parents, their two dads, they get to fighting. One of the dads has a baseball bat in his hand. Apparently, not thinking really too hard about it, decks this guy with a baseball bat, falls backward into the glass, loses an eye over it on accident like late late like it damages his eye the dude tries to grab his kid in peace i think they stop him on the way out but he like didn't even read like he just like went primal on this guy hey dude. you've heard horror stories about on black friday people getting trampled dude and you know what I love it, dude. Yeah. Um, <laughs> wow. Me and my homies went one year. Like, we went just to cause mischief, dude. We, we hit a couple doorbusters. We grabbed them from Walmart, and we just held on to them. Maybe 10, 15 minutes later, we dropped one of the doorbusters on the ground in the center of yeah, Walmart. And be it. like, but what's the printer? And put it down. And people, ooh, and they just, bro, we I was causing mischief. What up? Oh, here, this boy's going to know. Robert, what is your favorite Thanksgiving dish, bro? What are you looking forward to the most? The ham. ham bro, we didn't even think good. about the ham. Yeah. Honey baked like, like or a what? Big ham steak? Ooh, honey, honey baked, baked yeah, bro. For real. Honey baked, they have, that's like a, those. For size. Ooh. Gravy? Gravy or you no gravy guy? Maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. Some guys are no gravy. Fuck them. Okay, <laughs> you like mashed potatoes? Have the wait, wait, wait. How about this? How about this? Who the fuck calls it smashed potatoes, dude? Don't tell me, Robert. Wait, did, he say did you say smash, dude, or mashed? Mashed? It's mashed. It's not smashed, mashed. dude. <laughs> I guarantee we'll find someone in here who calls it smashed potatoes. Hey, Edwin. <laughs> now, there yeah. is such a thing as smashed potatoes. But they're, they're What's different? the difference between smash and mashed? I thing? thought it was an because East Coast, West Coast thing. I feel like East Coast definitely no. says smash. Yeah, no, no, you just take well. you take little rose potatoes, and then you just... Oh, smashed okay. potatoes. Yeah, sure. But they're not mashed potatoes. But yeah. I, there's people I said, who, like, there's, there's difference. I forget, but one time I called them mashed potatoes, and I was verbally just assaulted by people, dude. Really? Mashed? What are you saying? It's mashed. What are you, hooked on phonics? I'm like, no, that's what it's <laughs> it called. Was. Bro, you it's like it's animals. Like classic, like, 1990s television. It's mashed potatoes, yeah, bro. Dude. Here's the thing, though. I always try to set myself up. I always try to oh, save the room. Trade. Oh, the trade! Oh! Jason goes into losers. Ty! Ty. <laughs> Look at him! Fire him, Ty! Him. Send him! Lay him give off, him, dude! Give him, give him the box, bro! Tell him to pack his desk! Dude! That's it! <laughs> wow. And Ty is shook right now. He's verbally shook. Oh. One of the guys on the PCs looked at me in the eye like he wanted to like, put like, a knife happened? in yeah, dude. Hey, he probably calls them smashed potatoes and he's hated, bro. Did that really happen? <laughs> hey, 